So as we're walking up guys, this is the archway to the actual cemetery that's next door. Do you know any history on this supposed to be haunted or something? That's what people reckon online. Really? Yeah, I don't know how true it is, but they say it's haunted. I'm on my own. Good guys, it's your boy Shano. Uh, yeah, I'm at uh, Acton Bernal Castle tonight alone, or Action Bernal Castle if you've seen part one on the daytime. Uh, yeah, <laughs> this is going to be crazy. I'm alone, but this place is next to a graveyard too, so this is going to be creepy as hell because there is like sightings apparently of ghosts at this place. So I'm going to go alone and see what I find. What do you think? Crazy or insane or what? Or just got a lot of balls. <laughs> but either way, we're just around the corner from the castle now and we're gonna head in in a sec. Just wanna show you this here. So as we're walking up guys, this is the archway to the actual cemetery that's next door. I don't know if you can quite make it out. But over in the distance. That's too dark. I don't have my torch on me. I only have my camera light, so <laughs> this is going to be crazy guys, we'll see you when we get there. So we come across the sign guys, we're going to head in to Acton Bernal, or Action Bernal, as I kept pronouncing it, as I've said. Now it says online that this is open 24 hours, so fingers crossed, yes it is, sweet. Better shut the gate, please close the gate. Guys, this is where we're walking down. I'm going to try to film as much as I can because I don't want to miss anything. As I say, I am alone. If you look all the way around me, there is nobody with me. Unless it's something paranormal, obviously. I think I should have changed my shoes though. Currently forgot my torch, which is my own fault. The graveyard's down there, guys. Well, that was my own fault. I was rushing out because I needed to get this location sorted at night time. It says opening hours is any reasonable time in the daylight hours. that time <laughs> and we're exploring the last time I come here guys I just told you. The last time I come here I know that I didn't actually do a good video so I want to try and show a bit more of the castle so fingers crossed you can see more of the castle which I will show you now we're heading down to Probably can't make it out in the distance because, as you see, I'm literally in the middle of nowhere at the moment. Hi, right, guys. I'm doing what's that? I thought I was seeing things. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm just filming, so nighttime visits. <laughs> Do you know any history on this supposed to be haunted or something? That's what people reckon online. Really? 
<laughs> yeah, I don't know how true it is, but they say it's haunted. Well, I hope not, because I go to school next door. <laughs> apparently so, apparently they caught loads of ghosts in here and that, so... I don't know how true it actually is. Is that what it is next door, then, at school? Yeah. Because I wasn't sure last time I come. Ah, okay, right. So this was a park that we were at last time, guys. And uh, my mate was making noises when we were here. Which we'll see on the daytime version. <laughs> this is the back of the castle. The last time I was here, I think it said something about that it was supposed to be a farm. Don't know how true that is. Recreation. So we'll just walk around and hopefully see if there is anything here. Now there was a sign somewhere, I think it was down here, that mentioned about the farm being recreation. I'm just being told that obviously next door is actually a sixth form college, so last time we come we didn't know, actually know what it was, but this time we do. This was a sign that we come across last time. In the Middle Ages, Acton Bernal was both functioning farm and a place of recreation. But as I say, next door there is actually a, a cemetery and obviously a college that's just over there. So we're still at the other side of the castle now. My lights are a bit dim. Outside of the castle. So you've never seen nothing here, no? No. No. I mean, there's the old parliament buildings in the school grounds. Oh, okay. So I doubt you'll be able to get onto this yeah, place. Yeah, yeah. And then the cemetery's next door. Yeah. But obviously, I don't like going in cemeteries because it's like disturbing the peace and stuff. So. Yeah. Well, a lot of other YouTubers do. <laughs> well, it's not something that I'm into. Explore with Shayna. Yeah, just uh, type in Explore with Shayna, you should be able to find me. So, no problem. So, guys, we're still heading around the sides now. Uh, still on the outskirts. Just going to head into it. This is where Brasso was last time in the archway. Side. It's slippy, I've got little shoes on for this. Try 
line up yet, Woody. This is where Brasso was last time. Obviously, people were climbing up there last time as well. The lads decided to go a bit dimmer than what usually is. Inside to another one. Like I say, a lot of people climb up here. I'm not going to climb it. Just respecting the ruins. Obviously, a lot of people don't. This is the other one that just leads back out to the back of the castle. Size shots. And as I say, guys, I am alone. There was nobody else with me tonight. Usually, Chris comes with me. Sometimes Dean. Obviously, Ant as well. Tonight, it's just me. to show you guys a night time shot it's not as good because I haven't got my torch with me this is a 360 shot around the castle Right then guys, we're going to do a quick spirit box session. I've got it set up ready behind me and I want to know if this place is actually haunted. So we're going to see. Obviously I don't believe in these apps as you know, but we're going to try them anyway. So let's see what happens. The reason why I kept looking that way though is because you can probably hear the voices. There's a college down there. So, decompose, okay. So the lights are off. Beans. So the lights are off now. Is there anybody here? Anything paranormal? Pack. Pack. Anything at all? Anything paranormal? Family. There's a family here. Is that correct? See, this is what I don't like about these apps, guys. They just spit out words. So, if there's a family here, give me a name. Quiver. Quiver. Well, I'm not quivering. So, I don't know why you say quiver. Iron. Iron. Iron nerves, nerves of steel. So give me a name. If there's somebody here, give me a name. And that is not a name. I'm on my own. Yeah, really, I'm on my own. Unless there's anything paranormal. So, 
Is there anything paranormal here? I'm going to look around quickly. Catherine. Catherine, okay. So you give me a name now, have you? Right. Hello, mate. <laughs> yeah. Hi guys, I'm sorry but I, I had to stop that. Um, a dog just come out of nowhere to me. <laughs> but there's two of them, there was a dog walker. And yeah, it made me jump a little, I won't lie. I wonder who it was. But we're going to resume like what, where we left off and we're going to go to a different part of the castle. Gonna start again. Started scanning. Hopefully, we won't have any interruptions this time. Okay. You see a light, guys? That's me. So last time, we've just done it. Second again. I want to know if there's anybody here. We have people coming. Scanning stopped. Hey guys, third time lucky, let's do it. Started scanning. Sorry about the interruptions, guys. So, just, um, you told me your name was Catherine. Is Catherine still here? Equal. What I want to know is if Catherine is still here. If you are, then use this box to talk to me. Or use this app to talk to me. The voices you can hear, guys, is actually kids and that one around here. But obviously the parents. So is Catherine still here? Unholy. Bill. Bill? I'm just wondering if Catherine is still here. As I just mentioned a minute ago, you just told me that your name is Catherine. Actually. Actually. Yeah, you said your name was Catherine, so is Catherine still here? If Catherine isn't here, is anybody here? Vacation. Vacation. I need a vacation. Phone. <laughs> That's crazy because I actually have my phone in my hand, as you can see here with the light on. <laughs> so yes, I do have my phone in my hand. Indicate. We're just spitting words out to you guys. So guys, um, I've just been for a bit because obviously I'm going to try and check out this graveyard as well. So I'm going to head down there now. See just in front of me, probably a bit dark. I haven't got my torch. But yeah, I'm going to head to the graveyard now. So we're here guys. The arch like before. Heading inside. I think I'm going to be There we go. Started scanning. So, is there anything here you 
just to talk to me. Elsie. Elsie. Straight away we have a name. Elsie. So are you present with me now? get myself a proper spirit box and we'll see if anything is real. As you know, I don't believe in this. I never after never will do unless something can change my mind. Keep hearing footsteps around me guys. Is there anybody here? Sorry if you can't see guys, I really wish I brought a torch with me. Yeah, I'm in a graveyard. I'm trying to get a picture of this here. So guys, um, I think that's all we've got time for now because nothing's happening. It's um, been an okay explore. Shame that obviously people turned up, but as you can still hear in the background, the people still there. But we'll definitely probably be coming back for a revisit when there's a few of us with us so we can do a few different... Um, investigations but as always guys you know what you gotta do you gotta stay blessed stay safe i'll see you in the near future peace As you see, we're just heading to the cave. We will be there soon, but look at this track. It's absolutely disgraceful to walk through. Yeah, they don't go nowhere. <laughs> I walked off and there was something following me walking. And guys, I don't know why my camera's going all blurry. I'm trying to get it right. <laughs> why is there always problems with my camera when I get here? Cool. Always, guys. Always look how blurry it's gone.